I am Rafael. You and Letitia Sykes, Yale. My name is Letitia Sykes. I live in Kansas City, Missouri. If you are looking for a passionate person who is hardworking and dedicated, look no further. With enthusiasm and zeal, I would love to teach at your school. I have a bachelor's degree in business management. I also am receiving a certification for my TESOL so I can come teach overseas. For many years I have worked with children in, of many ages, many creeds and religions. I have learned various skills throughout my education and professional career and with the utmost confidence my skills will be perfect to teach your children English. Throughout my life, I have worked for various companies with various people of all ages. I worked with preschoolers, middle schoolers, high schoolers, adults of all ages. From the time I was 16, I worked and also I worked for a company called Youth Biz. Youth Biz Inc. was in the state of Colorado. We worked with disadvantaged youth between the ages of 15 to 18 year old, teaching them business, life skills, and organizational skills. We also had to make presentations to companies so we can get business. We had to make presentations regarding our background, our life stories, and any questions that the company may have about our company called Youth Biz Inc. After I worked at Youth Biz, I also worked for Community Blood Center of the Ozarks. Community Blood Center of the Ozarks in, is in Springfield, Missouri. I worked there for 12 years. I greeted people. I worked with computers. I also did presentations and recruitment for donations. From the time I was 14, I enjoyed babysitting and working in churches with the preschoolers, teaching them their colors and words. I know I would be the perfect candidate to teach your children. And in a moment, I'll give a small lesson on what you may need for your school. Hello, class. The lesson today is to teach you about different things that need to be cleaned around the kitchen. Let me tell you a story. Cinderella had evil stepsisters and an evil stepmother and they were so mean. They wouldn't let her go to the ball. But she knew she had to clean the kitchen but she couldn't do it all by herself she needs everyone in this class to help her and everyone in the class today will help Cinderella and if we help Cinderella she can go to the ball Oh yes, the ball where she could dance and meet the prince and live happily ever after. So we'll go in the kitchen and we'll look at the various things that we need to help Cinderella clean. Today, we need to help sell Cinderella clean the plate. We'll help Cinderella clean the plate. Oh my, we need to help Cinderella clean the glass. Oh yes, we have to help Cinderella clean 
the glass. Oh, we also have to help Cinderella clean the fork. We need to help Cinderella clean the fork. We also need to help Cinderella clean the pan. We all will help Cinderella clean the pan. We also will help Cinderella clean the knife. Let's all help Cinderella clean the knife. We also will help Cinderella clean the spoon. Yes, we will help Cinderella clean the spoon. We will put all these things into the sink. Put all the utensils and dishes and glass in the sink. And we can help Cinderella go to the ball. Now we all help Cinderella go to the ball because we helped her clean the kitchen. Didn't we do a good job today, class? And thank you for all your help. I have the educational and professional skills to be the perfect fit at your school. I will help with compassion, understanding, and teach your kids to grow to be productive adults. Please give me this opportunity to teach your children. Please consider me to be at your school to teach your children English. Kamsan hamdiyah. I know.